What's going on, everyone? It's the Nisco. Welcome back to Danganronpa. In the last episode, we finished up Chapter 2, and now it is time to hang out with the social links that we missed in Chapter 2, the ones that could not be finished. So, on today's docket, we have to finish up... And, spoiler alert if you're just joining us, we need to finish up Mondo and Shihiro, the said victims of Chapter 2. That's so unfortunate. The good part about this is, it won't take as long as the other ones, because the other social links you couldn't actually access for a specific number of days, and that made it take forever. But with Mondo and Chihiro, we've already gone through one of their four. They both have four scenes with you, and after that they are completely finished. So, we're already good on Chihiro and Mondo, we've already gone through one rank. And another thing we need to do... Since I have plenty of Monokuma coins to spend, and a lot of presents that I don't have for these people we're going to be hanging out with, I need to go to the uh, Mono Mono machine and get some new presents. Hooray! And I must say, having to uh, do these episodes right after the chapter and having to go through the chapter multiple times, you realize how much text you've actually gone through before free time. Speeding up everything, it took about seven minutes to get to free time from the beginning of the chapter. Not too bad, but let's go. We're going to give it a shot. Come on, Mono Mono Machine, I need presents. I'll see you guys in a bit. I got a block. Awesome! I got a new item, and then a lucky, and that ended up being a new item. Look at that, we're almost done! Another lucky? Oh, you spoil me! I got potato chips! Something I have noticed while playing this many, many times, the more coins you put in, just, you know, just one coin for one prize, this is actually advantageous to you if you're trying to get enough presents to appeal to everyone. And if you're trying to... Oh, look at that, another lucky. And if you're trying to upgrade everybody's social link, it's good to just use one coin at a time. Because I've noticed, no matter what the repeat percentage is down there, more often than not, you're going to get a new item. So I guess you could say I'm cheating the system, or maybe I'm just getting very, very lucky... But I'm up to 77%. I've only gone through, like, uh, 40 coins. And my percentage has gone up by, like, 8% of, like, new items. Which is absolutely amazing. It's really easy to get all the presents in this one, apparently. Alrighty, I think we have enough presents to give to our two social links today. Went up to 82.84% just by putting in one coin at a time. I'm telling you, it's the easiest thing to get all the presents if you just go one coin at a time, if you have patience. Now, as for some of the presents we actually got, uh, these are getting uh, weirder and weirder, I, I must say. Just, uh, yeah, some of the things that I end up getting, I just can't believe are coming out of this mono mono machine. And a lot of them are just references to a bunch of different things, and then you get that, and I have two of them apparently, so uh, me and another guy will be sharing the Emperor's Thong. Excellent. But uh, here's one, a rose whip. Made from real roses, oh, look at that. But even the most beautiful rose has its thorns. Okay, I wonder... <laughs> I actually don't know who likes that. That's going to be really interesting when I give it to them. Because I'm totally going to give somebody that. Uh, actually, there is one really interesting thing I noticed going... Uh, just doing my research and figuring out uh, who likes what present. There are actually a few that everybody will just like by itself. Here is one of them. Everybody across the board will like this as a B-ranked item. And there's no particular reason, except it's it's basically like a class ring from Hope's Peak Academy. And it's a sign of friendship. I actually didn't notice that. Another one that I thought was really, really funny is actually 
I, I am actually wondering if I have it. Here we go. The Fun Plane. The newest popular portable game system. It has a high-def touchscreen, and you can also play music and videos, making for the perfect all-in-one media machine. I'm guessing this is a parody of a PlayStation Vita, or just a kind of like one-screen DS, but I'm assuming it's a Vita, and everybody likes it across the board with a B ranking. <laughs> it's uh, That's actually very helpful if you happen to not get a present that somebody likes with an A rank liking. You can just give them a B item and that should be enough to move on to a different social link. Now that we have enough presents, let's go meet with our first person. This is something I actually want to try. I never did try this uh, through my original playthrough, but this is right after Chihiro got yelled at by Byakuya. I want to see if she is actually good to go. Hmm. I wonder if she is good to go. You're right. There you go, a little change of scenery. Um. Never hurt anybody. Oh, of course. And let's see. So even if I give Chihiro a present, if my facts are correct. I will not get an advancement on the social link. So, I believe... Uh, which one is it? Okay, I was right. Curly in camera. Oh, there's no film! Huh? A present just for you. Just to see that smiling face. There it is. <laughs> so, uh, my facts were correct. Even though... I gave her a perfect item that was an A rank present. I did not get an advancement on that social link. I should have, but she was still feeling pretty down to give more details about herself. So, going back in time. Mondo, you are our winner today. How are you doing, buddy? Yo. Oh, no, nothing's wrong. And uh, I must apologize. I called you absolutely pathetic at the end of uh, Chapter 2. Tr uh, trust me, Mondo, I don't hate you. Jesus Christ. I just have a problem with people who uh, who don't really own up to their past mistakes and who can't face them again. Uh, just can't face them at face value. So, again, nothing against you. I just think you're a stupid coward. But we, uh, to, just to make amends, I didn't mean it. Honestly, I didn't mean it. Uh, let's give you a present. What are we going to give Mondo? He is a very big fan of the Sonic Cup of Noodles, but I don't have one, unfortunately. Uh, another thing he really likes, uh, if I can remember which one it is. Uh, he likes the roller slippers, which I already gave him. But again, we don't have one. Hmm... Oh, man. He likes the bindings. And this actually makes sense. They say when you wrap it around yourself, both body and soul become taut. Awesome! <laughs> it's just a bunch of bandages, man. Hell yeah. <laughs> Indeed you are. Lucky as shit. I'm glad you like it. Ugh, shit. Okay, man, I'm sorry. I mean, I can get you better bandages. No, I, I... I swear, I can get them in a different color. Are you talking about Byakuya? <laughs> Don't be mad at me, please. What? You wouldn't like me when... Uh, never mind. Is it because your hair? Ah, uh, okay. A free spirit. Ugh, shit. <laughs> Do you ever have, have you ever seen a person who just can't form the right words, so they just say "God, pissed off, shit." They just cu they just cuss a lot. It's actually kind of comical sometimes. What? What? Uh, one on one. Um. Look, when you said you wanted to get out of here and run wild, I didn't think we'd have to do a one on one. Yeah. Um, 
have you seen me? Have you seen how not muscular I am and how feeble I look? What? I'm, I'm like a mirror. You punch me and I shatter. I also make other people look good. <laughs> uh, uh, a bare knuckle brawl. He's talking. Uh, he's talking regular old fashioned hand to hand. He's talking fisticuffs. Huh? <laughs> but I don't wanna! <laughs> Good excuse, Makoto. Good excuse. What? What? <laughs> All this raw power. <laughs> that would be amazing to see. You and Sakura punching each other? That would be great! Huh? Did you ever think of somebody who's, like, matching your toughness? Yeah, 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 you can spar with her. Just look at her. D damn you! Oh. I like the honor. I like that. <laughs> I could just see Mrs. Owada just tugging Mondo by the ear saying, You did what to a girl?! Piece of shit! I wasn't accusing you of anything. I absolutely agree with this mindset. D damn you! Right, right. Uh, loose dog. Just a uh, really big yappy dog. Don't fuck with me. <laughs> Hi, my name is Mondo! Will you go out with me? <laughs> that would be... That would be hilarious. I gotta see this Mondo. Ask somebody out, please. A 10-game losing streak? You've asked out ten people, and every single time you've yelled? Oh, man. Yeah. It's possible that I read that wrong, but that's what I was thinking of. Uh, I'll let you punch a Fumi. Aw, oh, man. We've done depressed Mondo. Oops. So he has an honorable side. <laughs> Shh. Don't say a word, Makoto. Heaven forbid he becomes a murderer. Pfft. And now we have Downshift. It's actually a really good ability. I'll have to show you later. The next person on the list is actually... It, oh, this is just a perfect scene right here. But Mondo, you are next on the docket. How you doing, my friend? This sucks. That would be kind of cool. All of us at the beach? Be pretty awesome. Hell yeah. Mondo, let's hang out again. I feel bad for making you depressed. It honestly wasn't my fault. I swear. Don't kill me. <laughs> let's murder some time together. These are getting really bad. Actually, yes, definitely. I have another A-ranked item to give him. And it makes so much sense that he would like this. Now I just need to find it. There it is. The Caldi Chinchilla Motorcycle Cover. Here you go, buddy. Enjoy. It's made out of 200 chinchillas. Hell yeah. Nice quality. Yo. Hey, what's up? Now, are we in serious Mondo mode or goofball? Okay, we're in serious mode. What? what? Shutting up. Oh. Didn't expect this one. Dog person or cat person? Stop fucking around. Okay, okay. I didn't know this was a matter of life and death. 
Good to know! I think I know what the answer to this mini quiz is! <laughs> Mondo is a dog person, so... Me, personally, I'm a cat person. And a dog person. But, uh, guess what happens when we choose a bear person? Huh? <laughs> well, just look at them! Aren't they... cute? <laughs> uh, and then Monokuma shows up going, Hey! <sighs> shit. <laughs> I'm sorry, Mondo, I couldn't resist. Piece of shit! Okay, I got it. A one or the other question. No Monokuma's allowed. Alright, no! I don't even want to experience a haymaker from you. Or a pile driver. Oh, that's another thing I should mention. If you get the wrong answer, it'll let you know which answer you chose. And we did lose a, a bit of points, but with that gift I gave him, it didn't do anything. Mondo's a dog person. All of a sudden, I'm a dog person too. What? No, no, no. I love them. Yeah. Totally true. Hell yeah. Yeah, that's right. Especially puppies. They're so adorable. Oh, God. We're going to depress Mondo again. Oh, man. Mondo, it's, it's nothing, really. Oh, really? He was the best dog I never had. I called him my brother. Yo. Rest in peace, Chuck. Or a Rottweiler. By the way. Hell yeah! God, you've taught your dog so many tricks. The only one mine could learn was play dead. I'm sorry, that was really bad. <sighs> I hate to tell you, Mondo, but you brought it up. Yeah, it's like losing a part of the family, losing a pet. It's not fun. Don't even look at me! I... I just... Wow. Mondo's got a soft side. Kind of figured this would happen, because everybody technically has a soft side. But I didn't think Mondo would drop his guard in front of me when it comes to pets. I just love cute shit! Huh. So he's 110% a dog person. Good to know. Next time he threatens to beat me up, I'll just have to throw a puppy at him. Now we have unlocked upshift. So you can probably imagine what it does in relation to downshift that we got last time. As soon as I tell you what it means. Next person on the list, we're actually going to go a little bit out of order this time. But as soon as I can find her, not Hifumi, unless he decides to wear a wig, I don't know. Chihiro, how you doing? Hello there. What's up? You've got that smile on your face and I love it! Yay! Oh, and that yay! Glad you're feeling up to actually doing something. It's about time. Nah, I'm kidding. Let's go ahead and give you that present I meant to give you in another life. Let me see, it was... Uh, where is it? Ah, there it is. A camera. Try thinking of about technical things to give Chihiro. The camera is a very good example and an A-plus item. Yay! You like it, yay! <laughs> <laughs> Oh, 
Awesome. Oh. I mean, it was a camera. What's ailing you? You know. Everybody's got their part. You just gotta find it. But, but. Oh, come on now. Isn't there something you can tinker with to make things explode? That'd be kind of cool. <laughs> well, hey, actually, that could be useful. Exactly. Your skills are detrimental to our escape. I mean, have you seen my skill? Huh? Yeah, I'm lucky. Woohoo! <laughs> Wait. I'm lucky. The Mono Mono machine now makes so much more sense. That's right. You are the ultimate programmer. You have that go-getter attitude. I love it. Huh? Yeah, how does one get a skill like this? It's pretty impressive. <laughs> Uh-oh. Mm, knowing what we know now? Nope. How does someone like you get into a computer? Maybe it's a family connection. That's kind of the best way to learn things, is just fool around until you learn something. Um... Ah, yep, family connection. I called it Microsoft Word. Um. Oh, cool. You know? Oh, wow. So you made a program where it would go look for what you were looking for. Wait. They don't have to type? Whoa, wait a minute. Are you telling me? They actually spoke to it? <laughs> oh my gosh, you're a genius. <laughs> this is far beyond anything we have. Wow! She made her own friend! With voice recognition, too! Um... Yeah, that was probably... abnormally tricky. Because everybody's got a different accent or a bite to their language. I can only imagine. There's seven different ways to say hi. You're right. Uh-oh. Busted. But you turn it into a multi-million dollar corporation, right? <laughs> yeah, student has surpassed the master. Can you imagine something that was so smart it could pull different words that you would say? I would just like to challenge it to see how many words it knew. You save the world, Shihiro, one program at a time. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that would probably uh, put a dent in Daddy's wallet. <laughs> hmm. 
<laughs> That's awesome. You go, girl. Wait. Just as long as you don't try to make out with your computer. You should have seen what Hifumi was doing the other day. Uh. You're fascinating! Huh? Who doesn't want to learn about a computer whiz? Next thing you know, you're going to start a subgroup called Anonymous. <laughs> Jehiro hacks the world. Deal. Can't say no to that face. And we now have Algorithm. Algorithm is another really cool technique that I actually know what it does. You remember memorizing truth bullets? Well, Algorithm makes it go faster. Dangan